All right, so here's some nice berms if you come in the other direction. Well, when I came out this morning, I don't know if I had the camera on for this, but these are some really nice berms in here. Look at them, they go right around. Wow. Wow, yeah, even I got up on the wall a little bit there. Some more downhill on the Cooper Union. Heading back. I generally record the uphill because it seems so grueling and just tricky and, and but it, it's not, never seen in the video, so. I know people like the downhills. Right, so this is the white trail going back. I just turned off of the Cooper Union. Throwing a couple high speed downhills for you. And this is the way I came out. But I believe going back is more downhill, which you can see all through here. And this is the rock garden section up here. Not certain what gear I want. I think I want one higher. I don't need to be covering the brakes. So go off of that. Keep the pedals going. That's how you get through that. Oh, the gnats were insane back in that other section. Insane, they weren't letting up. I took both, the one bug spray doesn't work at all. And then even the other one, it deterred them just slightly. And then they came back. That's when you need deet. You know, the deet. I like the natural herbs and spices or whatever the heck is in what I use. I think this is the old crossover that nobody uses anymore. I took it one time. I know it's got a massive climb at the end or something. Let's just see. There's a cross Morris and let's just see what happens back here. I hope that's what it is. I hope it's not one of the hiking type trails that you just can't ride on. And then that's a crazy over in this section. Kind of going back where I was. Never could have done that before. Never, ever, ever. Never, ever, 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 ever. <laughs> Over the water. And there's going to be a spot to get in over here. So I just jumped back in. I think this is the old trail.
part. Well, I'm not getting through that. That I don't have the power to get through. Yep, I don't have the power to get through uh, coming down, and I would have went through it, but not this way. Where are we going? Here to the right still, yeah. Like I said, this is the old, the old crossover. An old trail that nobody uses anymore. Go back and look at that. I'm gonna go back and try that one again because I might be able to get up that sucker. GoPro, stop recording. All right, there's a big tree down. Don't know if I can get up it, but try and get it. I got it. I got it. Damn. Because I was stopped at the top, and it was like so unusual. What I had to do was so unusual. I got it though. I had to like wait and just like uh, I don't know how to explain what I did, but. We got first try. Well, I mean, I rolled into it thinking, should I do it? Then I didn't even try it. Then I backed up and I did it first attempt. Make sure the camera's on. Now this is fun. I did it one time, something different. Brings us all the way up to, you know, the visitors, I mean, the whole sky lanes and all that. And there's a big climb at the end. Some big grave. Now, what do we have up here? up there, I can't see. How do I, I guess I just get across over here. Can I make it through this mud? There we go. Watch your head here in your knapsack, Ron. There you go. And I believe there was a section that went out to the homes up here. I think I went the wrong way one time. You can see the now that I have the, again, I mapped all these things on Trail Force. Now I can see them. Now that I was able to update you know, to the Garmin. Garmin gives you the Trail Force routes, trails. But they only do it, you know, a couple times a year or three times a year. I don't know if they do it every quarterly. But there was one there last month I put it on. And I can see this whole, all this trail, which is beautiful. Because I did so much work on Trail Forks last year. And until things were, you know, until things were uploaded, I couldn't do anything. All right, so going through here. That was just pure power. That's all I did there, just pure power. Just fighting my way through there. All right, so there's a whole lot of them up here. I don't know if I can do that through here. Let's get one more gear. I stand. That's it. Keep standing. That's what it was, Rob. Just if I stand. And I'm not certain which way we're going here. Let me take a look. GoPro, stop recording. All right, so this is a real steep grade up here. I didn't know whether to go to the right or to the left, but to the right goes to the homes. I have to get through right here without slipping. Really steep. Really steep. Without slipping. Let's 
and the wet rest. Insane climb, insane. Heart rate, 160, 150, 160. I'm not getting up here. No way. Look at that. Look at that. No way. Look at this. There's got to be 40% green. It's got to be 40% here. and all these big loose rocks. Thirty-five to forty for sure. Because I'm leaning back on the bike, pushing. I can hardly get up. Really should be done in the other direction. But I, I want to make that climb at the bottom what I did, which I did. All right, so this is where I just came out at the end of the old crossover. It had the black dot. It was a bright, bright blaze with a black dot in the middle. All right, just a, a view of what's coming up. I'm heading in. This is the paved section of the crossover trail. It cuts through the Skylands, you know, uh, botanicals and all that. Beautiful up here. Got to come up in the car and check it out sometime. We're right up Morris Road. All right? Look for Morris Road, and you can ride up Morris Hill, come through here, and then on the other side of the park, you can go back over and climb Ringwood, you know, Skyline Drive in the long direction towards Oakland. So this is where the trail goes to the right. We missed it this morning. So I'm going to get this in the video here for you now. And I know coming into this trail, it's just a tricky little climb. I say tricky, I mean just, you know, just a short two second effort around a pole or a tree or something up a rock. Well, these first, again, I remember when John was telling me that they start here, and I was trying to figure out what, how, what are these trails on the map? Like, how do you get from the school to uh, every, everywhere else? And this is, I was trying to figure all this out. Here. Is this the tricky spot getting up? Yeah. <laughs> that was a little tricky spot getting up. Okay, now we didn't go straight, did we? No, I'm doing good here. Okay.
and we go straight across here it's always nice to finish off and not be totally wiped out my first year when I was doing 25 and 30 miles all the time out for like eight hours straight and longer I was wiped out coming back just wiped out Those bamboo. That's bamboo. <laughs> Where did I see that last time? I saw the bamboo someplace else too. Alright, so we continue across here. Trying to get to that black bear. So this will come out to is it Skylands Road? I think I make the left and then a the right to get into Black Bear. the Skyline Road. There it is right there on the right. All right. Black Bear finishing up. Last trail. Last trail. Come over from the left here when you're coming down Warren Puppy and all that. All right, so I go to the left here to get on Black Bear, I believe. I believe. <laughs> I hope. Yeah, boy, that's a powerful power move there. I came around it crooked. I'm not gonna do that again because I know I make it. I came around it off off balance. <laughs> off balance. And I was in a high gear, so I don't normally hit that with such speed. So geez, I'm in a gigantic gear now, yeah. I don't normally hit that with such speed. But if you're going to, you have to know that's gonna be there waiting for you. Yeah, because a couple of these, you take some of the spots wide, that's how you get through it. That beginning part is tough. A lot of these spots that are tough when you come with speed, you have to handle them differently than the way I'm used to. All right, so when I come around this left-hand turn up here, 
I'm going over the rock. Is it right here? <laughs> that was the worst. I got through it, but that was the worst ever. I don't know what type of rock I went over. I went over the, the biggest. I hung on, but that was the worst ever going through there, boy. Black bear. If I didn't fall on that first one, I would have had a real good run through there. Oh, my thumb's hurting now. The one that I sprained last week. We go down right down here that's always tricky look at that that's crazy <laughs> you got to get up here to get back to the car So there you have it, that's black bear. Finishing up at the school here. My car is still waiting for me. Almost 1,700, almost 1,700 feet of elevation. Almost 15 miles. 